It's so much fun just hearing my friends be like, oh my gosh, this is so much fun to play. It's great. Grants Pass High School senior Nathaniel Lee has been working since October on an orchestral piece he composed. It's titled The Last Words of Philippides, which is named after a Greek mythological figure who is said to have run from Marathon to Athens. For Lee, the composition of this piece has also been somewhat of a marathon. I like recorded, I think it was eight minutes of me just playing improv of just stuff in the same key as the piece and then went back and listened to it and like parts that I'm like, oh, this is nice. Now Lee is set to travel up the Oregon coast to Newport where his piece was selected to be performed at the Oregon Coast Youth Symphony Festival. It will allow Lee to work with professional musicians and he'll have dozens of people in the audience to see it performed. I got the email saying, you know, your piece was chosen for this and all that. I was like, am I dreaming? Like I was at lunch and then when I'm realized I wasn't dreaming, I like kind of freaked out because I'm like, this is incredible. Lee also had a mentor to help guide him through composing this piece in the form of Ashland native Ethan Gans Morse. Gans Morse has composed music professionally and he's been a part of the Youth Composer Symposium for years. I felt very privileged to be one of these clinicians, but the work came from Nathaniel and um, so I feel proud to be in a role where um, Hopefully, the, the guidance that I and other clinicians can give is, is helpful for young composers to find their way. Gaines Morse met with Nathaniel regularly over the last six months to provide some guidance on how to compose music for an entire orchestra. Lee is a viola player in the Grants Pass High School Orchestra, but he says he learned a lot about how to write for other instruments. Last year, or even like the beginning of this year, I couldn't read the music for the other instruments. Like, I could get a few notes, but not really anything, and now it's like I can figure it out. 